Hi Cyrus and Dr. Grady. To me, CO2 is the most useful gas essential for growth of all vegetation, plants, fruits, crops, Amen. and like. Without it, we would, be, we would perish and more we would have stronger growth we get. What are, those, uh, what are those who oppose it talking about? It makes no sense to me. How do you justify climate change if they mean global warming when um, they have been in the Scotland during the last six months? Thanks for a great programme, Duncan in Inverness. I think you wrote that one, didn't you, Grady? Pretty close, pretty close. <laughs> no, I, I like Duncan and Inverness. Of course, I, I like Inverness. Um, but the fact of the matter is, CO2 is not a hazardous greenhouse gas. Now, water vapor in the atmosphere is what captures the most heat of all of the things that are in the atmosphere, including carbon dioxide, carbon monoxide, etc. The fact of the matter is, though, it is an essential ingredient for life. And I have said this before, and I will say it again, I hope very carefully. God is not a God of haste or waste, but we should be burning all the fossil fuels that we could get our hands on if it were for a useful purpose. So no haste, no waste, no pollution for the sake of polluting, but we should be releasing all the carbon dioxide that has been sequestered simply because the plants would absorb it, producing more food for a growing population. We have now hit 8 billion people on Earth. Uh, we need more food. We need more wood. Carbon dioxide is what plants use to make food and wood. Uh, by sequestering this, by trying to, quote, reduce your carbon footprint, you are, in fact, actually starving people to death around the world.